Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to Santa Maria Goretti Parish. Let us pray the Angelus. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The angel of the Lord declared unto Mary, And she conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Behold the handmaid of the Lord. Be it done unto me according to thy word. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And the word was made flesh. And dwelt among us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women. And blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Pray for us, O Holy Mary, Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. Pour forth, we beseech thee, O Lord, thy grace into our hearts, that we to whom the incarnation of Christ, your Son, was made known by the message of an angel, may by his passion and cross, be brought to the glory of his resurrection through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Let us pray the Holy Rosary. We offer this Holy Rosary for the continued recovery of our country and the world from the crisis brought by the COVID-19 pandemic. For those who lost their jobs and those who struggle in their livelihood, for good governance in our country and in the world, for peace in the world where war and violence exist, for the sick, especially those afflicted with COVID-19, that God may give them strength and full recovery, and for the eternal repose of our dearly departed, especially those who died from COVID-19, and may God console their grieving families. I believe in one God, the Father Almighty, maker of heaven and earth, of all things visible and invisible. I believe in one Lord Jesus Christ, the only begotten Son of God, born of the Father before all ages, God from God, light from light, true God from true God, begotten not made, consubstantial with the Father, through him all things were made. For us men and for our salvation, he came down from heaven, and by the Holy Spirit, was incarnate of the Virgin Mary and became man. For our sake, he was crucified under Pontius Pilate. He suffered death and was buried, and rose again on the third day in accordance with the scriptures. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of the Father. He will come again in glory to judge the living and the dead, and his kingdom will have no end. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Lord, the giver of life, who proceeds from the Father and the Son, who with the Father and the Son is adored and glorified, who has spoken through the prophets. I believe in one holy, Catholic, and apostolic church. I confess one baptism for the forgiveness of sins, and I look forward to the resurrection of the dead and the life of the world to come. Amen. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, 
pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, it's now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. The Sorrowful Mysteries The First Mystery, The Agony in the Garden Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of your mercy. The second sorrowful mystery, the scourging at the pillar. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. 
Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Glory, Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be a world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven especially those in most need of your mercy, the third sorrowful mystery, the crowning with thorns. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, Forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of your mercy. The fourth sorrowful mystery, the carrying of the cross. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. 
Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Glory, Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be a world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of your mercy. The fifth sorrowful mystery, the crucifixion and death. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, 
And blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of your mercy. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy, Hail our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To you do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To you do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn thy most gracious advocate, your eyes of mercy towards us, and after this our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of your womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, Pray for us, O Holy Mary, Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, whose only begotten Son, by His life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal salvation, grant, we beseech you, that meditating upon these mysteries of the Most Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. For the intention of the Holy Father, our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Mary, Mother of God, pray for us. Saint Joseph, pray for us. Saint Padre Pio, pray for us. Santa Maria Goretti, pray for us. Tridum Prayer in Honor of St. Martin de Porres Act of Contrition O oh my God, I am heartily sorry for having offended you, and I detest all my sins, because I dread the loss of heaven and the pains of hell, but most of all, because I have offended you, O oh my God, who are all good and deserving of all my love, I firmly resolve with the help of your grace, to confess my sins, to do penance, and amend my life. Amen. Opening prayer. Most humble Martin de Porres, your charity embraced not only your needy brethren, but also the very animals of the field. We hail you and invoke you, splendid example of charity. Listen to the prayers of your needy brethren, that by imitating your virtues, we may we live contented, contented in that state in which God has placed us, carrying with strength and courage our cross. We may follow the footsteps of our blessed Redeemer and His most afflicted Mother, that at last we may reach the kingdom of heaven through the merits of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. By your intense love for man's spiritual needs and cares, and your desire to discover God's goodness in all things. Guide me, St. Martin, that I may see God in all things. By your shining example in Christian detachment from worldly and material pleasure that made you nearer to what is supernatural and divine. Pray, St. Martin, that I may continually grow spiritually in God's grace. By your practice of strict poverty, as a means to attain your holiness and intimate friendship with God. We implore you, St. Martin, make us poor in heart and spirit. O Lord, you have given to the world a glorious apostle of humility, St. Martin de Porres. Guide us by his example and strengthen us through his intercession in our efforts to conform our hearts 
to the humble heart of your crucified Son, Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Please mention your petitions. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Saint Martin de Porres, you always had sympathy to the poor and those who were suffering. We need your help, and now ask for it with great confidence in your goodness and power. The favors you receive from God encourage us now to ask your intercession. We ask you most humbly to befriend us and assist us from your place in heaven. When you were here on earth, you spent your life loving God and your neighbor. Now that you live in the presence of God, intercede for us and beg the divine physician to give us health of soul and body. Amen. Saint Martin de Porres, I turn to you in my sorrow to ask for your friendly protection. Intercede for me with our merciful Father, so that I may be truly sorry for all my sins and be freed from all the evils that afflict us. Ask that I might have something of your spirit of love and self-sacrifice, so be at all times resigned to God's holy will. O oh, Heavenly Father, in the name of your Son and His beloved Mother, and by the merits of your faithful servant, St. Martin de Porres, help me in my needs. Amen. Blessing of the sick through the intercession of St. Martin de Porres. Our help is in the name of the Lord. Who made heaven and earth. O oh Lord, hear my prayer. And let my cry come to you. The Lord be with you. And also with you. Let us pray. Look down, O Lord, we beseech you, upon your servants who have grown weak under the weight of their sickness and comfort the souls which you have created, that being chastened in spirit, they may recognize your power to heal and save them. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. May the Lord Jesus Christ be with you to defend you, to preserve you, to guide you, to protect you, to bless you. He lives and reigns with the Father and the Holy Spirit forever and ever. Amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Please be seated. Saintly Martin, we have learned from the holy way you trod how your heart with ardor burned for the vision of your God. Good morning, dear brothers and sisters. Welcome to our celebration of the Holy Eucharist. 
we offer this Holy Mass for the thanksgiving of our donors and sponsors, for the eternal repose of the souls of our daily departed, for the healing of our online and in-person parishioners and their caregivers, for those who are unable to go to church physically for various reasons, and for all other intentions offered in this Eucharistic celebration. Today, we celebrate the memorial of St. Martin de Porres. Our Mass presiders, Reverend Father Jason Laguerta, please all stand. <laughs> Sacred heart, O oh love divine, do keep us near to Thee, and make our love so like to Thine, that we In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. We come to the sacred heart of Jesus on this first Friday of the month. We ask the intercession of St. Martin de Porres for healing of our infirmities for the sick members of our family. I confess to Almighty God and to you, my brothers and sisters, that I have greatly sinned in my thoughts and in my words, in what I have done and in what I have failed to do. Through my fault, through my fault, through my most grievous fault. Therefore, I ask the Blessed Mary, ever Virgin, all the angels and saints, and you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me to the Lord our God. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us all to everlasting life. Amen. Let us pray. O God, who led St. Martin de Porres by the path of humility to heavenly glory, that we may so follow his radiant example in this life as to merit to be exalted with him in heaven. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. Please be seated. A reading from the letter of St. Paul to the Romans. Brothers and sisters, I speak the truth in Christ. I do not lie. My conscience joins with the Holy Spirit and bearing me witness that I have great sorrow and constant anguish in my heart. For I could wish that I myself 
were accursed and cut off from Christ for the sake of my own people, my kindred according to the flesh. They are children of Israel. Theirs, the adoption, the glory, the covenant, the giving of the law, the worship, and the promises. Theirs, the patriarchs, and from them, according to the flesh, is the Christ, who is over all, God blessed forever. Amen. The Word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Praise the Lord, Jerusalem. Praise the Lord, Jerusalem. Glorify the Lord, O Jerusalem. Praise your God, O Zion. For he has strengthened the bars of your gates. He has blessed your children within you. Praise the Lord, Jerusalem. He has granted peace in your borders. With the best of wit, he fills you. He sends forth his command to the earth, swiftly runs his word. Praise the Lord, Jerusalem. He has proclaimed his word to Jacob, his statutes and his ordinances to Israel. He has not done thus for any other nation. His ordinances he has not made known to them. Praise the Lord, Jerusalem. Please all stand. My sheep hear my voice, says the Lord. I know them and they follow me. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Luke. Glory to you, O Lord. On the Sabbath, Jesus went to dine at the home of one of the leading Pharisees. And the people there were observing him carefully. In front of him there was a man suffering from dropsy. Jesus spoke to the scholars of the law and Pharisees in reply asking, asking, is it lawful to cure on the Sabbath or not? But they kept silent. So he took the man and after he had healed him, dismissed him. Then he said to them, who among you, if your son or ox falls into a cistern, would not immediately pull him out on the Sabbath day. But they were unable to answer his question. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Please be seated. Magandang umaga sa ating lahat, mga kapatid. Good morning, brothers and sisters. Pakibati din ng good morning ang ating katabi. It's first Friday and we honor the sacred heart of Jesus and also the feast day of St. Martin de Porres. Thank you for coming to our celebration this morning. And to our online parishioners, we pray also with you and for you, especially for the sick members of your family. Today, Jesus once again, healed somebody and the, the Pharisees and the scribes, they were not agreeable to it. Jesus healing people, especially on the Sabbath day. Jesus' mission was centered on two things, preaching and healing. He would preach the good news and he would heal 
those who were sick that were brought to him. So in this Mass, we also pray for healing through the intercession of St. Martin de Porres and also asking the Sacred Heart of Jesus to show his mercy upon us, especially those who are in pain, who are in suffering right now. Kahapon po, somebody told one of our volunteers, Father, napagaling po ako ni St. Martin. Instantaneously daw, experienced healing from St. Martin. Pero nagdududa nga kami kung si St. Martin ba, baka sa St. Ezekiel Moreno, o baka si Santa Maria Goretti, o baka si San Padre Pio, o mekos-mekos na sila. <laughs> And somebody said to us that may this church and parish be a center for healing. That's exactly what we had in mind. That's why we are bringing in all these saints as our intercessors for healing. We are waiting for the relic of St. Padre Pio to be, to be given to us also. So makakaroon tayo ng apat na first class relic. Santa Maria Goretti, San Isikel Moreno, of course, St. Martin de Porres, and San Padre Pio. Again, because our mission today, I strongly believe that our mission today is to become an instrument of healing for people. And it's not us who heal people. It is faith in the Lord that would enable someone to be strong that would give healing to a person in his or her sickness. So today, let us meditate on the life of St. Martin de Porres. Just in case you don't know, this image of St. Martin de Porres, together with a first-class relic in it, came from Cardinal Rufino Santos and his family. Ang uh, pamilya po ni Cardinal Santos, nakilala ko, and they generously offered to us this relic of St. Martin de Porres. Ito daw pong image na ito, uh, dati-rati ay hinihiram ng St. Martin de Porres Hospital kapag uh, fiesta ni St. Martin. Eh, hindi nila lang mahihiram ngayon, no? <laughs> Kasi nasa atin na. But nevertheless, this image and relic and not just the image and the relic, but the story of St. Martin de Porres. To be honest with you, I did not know him really before having this image before us. So when I was reading about his life, I was really blown away, but wow. Wow, what a story of a saint. Alam niyo po ba yung kwento ni St. Martin de Porres? Super, super talaga. So if, First of all, he was mixed race, biracial. Siya po ay anak ng isang Spanish, white, Caucasian, and black na indigenous woman. So he, he was a mulato or a mixed race and biracial. And at that time, it was frowned upon. Hindi pwede maghalo ang puti at itim. At nung lumabas si, si Martin, Ang akala ng tatay niya, which was white, akala niya puti, ay eh lumabas itim. Ayun, kaya nagalit yung tatay. This owned Martin and his sister also because they were dark in complexion. So very early on in life, he was, he was already subjected to discrimination and exclusion. Iniwanan ng tatay at pinalaki ng nanay. Grew up to be very poor an apprentice in a barber surgeon. So lahat ng mga pwede niyang gawin ay kanyang ginagawa para makatulong sa pamilya. But eventually, the father had a change of heart and uh, accepted them later on. But the life of St. Martin de Porres was really filled with so much suffering and hardship. Very early on in life, he wanted to be a Dominican, to be a religious Pero at that time, again, discrimination. Hindi siya tinanggap kasi nga, itim. So, hindi siya tinanggap ng mga Dominican. Yung mga Dominican talaga. No? So, at that time, no? at that time, hindi siya tinatanggap. Tinanggap naman siya, eventually, because of his persistence. Tinanggap, pero hindi siya pwedeng maging pare. And he remained a brother, never allowed to be a priest. Because of what? 
his complexion. But it did not deter him from serving the Lord and entering the religious life. And he would be assigned to the most menial task, the most menial jobs. So siya yung i-assign sa kitchen, sa garden, sa toilet, sa, sa mga bagay na madudumi. And he loved it. He loved serving. And also, in the life of St. Martin de Porres, he would always go out and help those who were in the streets, those who were abandoned, the slaves, those who had no one to take care of them. There was such love in his heart and charity for people around him, especially those who are suffering. So, kinukuha niya lahat. Minsan, daladala niya ang isang may sakit na punong-puno ng sugat. Ang sabi ng kanyang mga mga brothers sa community, bakit mo dinadala yan? Dumi-dumi yan. Ang sabi ni St. Martin sa kanila, Brother, which is the first commandment? Charity or cleanliness? There was this charity in his heart. And we can learn so much from St. Martin de Porres in terms of charity, in terms of love for the poor, of love for the sick. And because he was trained to be a surgeon, a barber surgeon at that time, he was able to heal so many. Kaya nung namatay po si St. Martin de Porres, pinag-agawa ng mga tao yung kanyang vestment, yung kanyang damit. Pinag-agawa nila kasi they wanted to have a piece of the saint because there was always instantaneous healing through the intercession of St. Martin de Porres. And we are so privileged that we are given a relic, a first-class relic of St. Martin de Porres before us. Imagine that. He lived in the 17th century. He died November 3, 1639. And we have a piece of him here today, right now. So we ask St. Martin de Porres to intercede for us, for those who are sick, for those who are suffering. Minsan, nawala ng pondo yung kanyang community. So ang ginawa ni Martin de Porres, siya po ay namalimus kung saan saan. And he was able to raise so much fund in order to put up of an orphanage, a hospital, and even paying for the dowry of many slaves. So St. Martin is also the patron saint of fundraisers. Kaya sa inyo po na may mga problema sa pera, lapit tayo kay St. Martin para ramihin niya yan. No? Uh, of course, hindi naman by uh, ngayon eh, Siguro papanalunin tayo sa loto or what, no? But in St. Martin, we can find a saint who was full of charity. That is why God's providence was abundant, overflowing in him. But I think the best characteristic of St. Martin is not his charity. It's not his ability to raise funds. The best quality of St. Martin de Porres was his deep prayer life. He would spend whole night in prayer before Jesus in the Blessed Sacrament. Kaya maganda rin naman na first Friday, we will have also an adoration of the Blessed Sacrament. Because that's what gave St. Martin de Porres the strength to be charitable and to serve people, the poor and the sick and the abandoned. He would levitate in prayer. He would bilocate and people would see him everywhere. His sanctity was all over, all coming from his devotion and love for Jesus in the Eucharist. So today, we have a saint before us, a saint who lived hundreds of years ago, but he is present among us, teaching us that even if we have come from the most disadvantaged circumstances in life, it's not an excuse for us not to love, and not to show compassion. So St. Martin de Porres experienced all the discrimination in life. Poor, excluded, not, in, not given admission to a community. If not for the prior who insisted that they violated the law of the community at that time. The Dominicans, they would not accept a mulatto, a mixed race. Pero sabi nung prior nila noon, hindi, tanggapin natin yung bata na yan. They also violated their own rule in the order to help Martin de Porres take care of the poor. So in St. Martin, we see a person who was disadvantaged, excluded, but persevered 
in his compassion, in his love and charity. And his order of sanctity extends to us even today. We are so privileged. We have the presence of Maria Goretti, the presence of Ezekiel Moreno, and now Martin de Porres. A physical presence, a piece of them, but a very powerful piece of their presence, of their sanctity. So today I invite you, we come to the sacred heart of Jesus, begging for healing once more. Jesus who healed in the gospel today, we ask also today that through the intercession of our friends, of our saints here in the parish, may we all be given the healing that we long for, that we beg the Lord to grant healing and comfort to our sick brothers and sisters. Dear friends, that my sacrifice in yours may be acceptable to God, our loving Father. May the Lord accept this sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of his name, for our good and the good of all his holy church. Most merciful God, who were pleased to create in blessed Martin de Porres, the new man in your image, the old having passed away, graciously grant, we pray, that renewed like him, we may offer you the acceptable sacrifice of conciliation through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation, always and everywhere to give you thanks, Lord, Holy Father, Almighty, Eternal God, for you are praised in the company of your saints, and in crowning their merits, you crown your own gifts. By their way of life, you offer us an example. By communion with them, you give us companionship. By their intercession, we are given sure support. With the angels and archangels, we sing the hymn of your praise, as without end we acclaim. A 
as we kneel before the Lord, we come to Jesus, ask Him for healing, for recovery, for our sisters and brothers who are afflicted with illness. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, these gifts, we pray, by sending down your Spirit upon them like the dew fall, that they may become for us the body and the blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread in giving thanks, broke it, gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice, once more giving thanks, gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. Please stand. The mystery of faith. For as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life, the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world. Bring her to the fullness of charity, together with Francis our Pope, Jose, our bishop, and all the clergy. And let us now lift up to the Lord our prayers and petitions in the family as we also pray for the intentions of our Mass today. Remember our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection we pray for our faithful departed, our loved ones who have died in your mercy. Welcome them, Lord, into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray. Lord, the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, Blessed Joseph, her spouse, the apostles and the saints, St. Martin de Portes, who have pleased you throughout the ages. We may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life and praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him, with him, in him. O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. children of the loving father no one is excluded in his family we belong to him we turn to the father as we pray as 
as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Grant peace in our days. By the help of your mercy, we may be free from sin, safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope, the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours now. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church. Graciously grant her peace and unity, in accordance with your will, who we'll live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Let us offer each other the sign of peace. Peace be with you. Peace be on. Take away the sins of the world. Have mercy, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Behold Jesus, the Lamb of God. Behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Behold him who heals us from our sickness. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word and my soul shall be healed. An act of spiritual communion. My Jesus, I believe that you are present in the most holy sacrament. I love you above all things, and I desire to receive you into my soul. Since I cannot at this moment receive you sacramentally, come at least spiritually into my heart. I embrace you as if you were already there, and unite myself wholly to you. Never permit me to be separated from you. Amen. Teach our hearts to love like yours. Love of God most high. Secret heart of Jesus keep 
us by your side. Save us all from death and sin. Our King crucified, crowned with thorns and sorrow. You give us new San Padre Pio after Holy Communion, stay with me, Lord, for it is necessary to have you present so that I do not forget you. You know how easily I abandon you. Stay with me, Lord, because I am weak and I need your strength that I may not fall so often. Stay with me, Lord, for you are my life and without you I am without fervor. Stay with me, Lord, for you are my light and without you I am in darkness. Stay with me, Lord, to show me your will. Stay with me, Lord, so that I hear your voice and follow you. Stay with me, Lord, for I desire to love you very much and always be in your company. Stay with me, Lord, if you wish me to be faithful to you. Stay with me, Lord, for as poor as my soul is, I want it to be a place of consolation for you, a nest of love. Stay with me, Jesus, for it is getting late and the day is coming to a close and life passes, death, judgment, eternity approaches. It is necessary to renew my strength so that I will not stop along the way and for that I need you. It is getting late and death approaches. I fear the darkness, the temptations, the dryness, the cross, the sorrows. Oh, how I need you, my Jesus, in this night of exile. Stay with me tonight, Jesus, in life with all its dangers. I need you. Let me recognize you as your disciples did at the breaking of the bread, so that the Eucharistic communion be the light which disperses the darkness, 
the force which sustains me, the unique joy of my heart. Stay with me, Lord, because at the hour of my death, I want to remain united to you, if not by communion, at least by grace and love. Stay with me, Jesus. I do not ask for divine consolation because I do not merit it. But the gift of your presence, oh yes, I ask this of you. Stay with me, Lord, for it is you alone I look for. Your love, your grace, your will, your heart, your spirit. Because I love you and ask no other reward but to love you more and more. With a firm love, I will love you with all my heart while on earth and continue to love you perfectly during all eternity. Amen. We pray for the family. Dearest Father in heaven, bless our family and bless us with new beginnings. Smile upon our parents and surround our children with the soft mantle of your love. Teach every child of ours to follow in your footsteps and to live life in the ways of faith, hope, and charity. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. In silence, we pray for the intentions of our family. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Mary, Mother of God, pray for us. Saint Joseph, pray for us. Santa Maria Goretti, pray for us. Please stand. This whole month of November, we pray for the repose of the souls of our departed brothers and sisters. And so we pray, Lord, listen to our prayers for our departed brothers and sisters whose names we remember today. They have always desired to do your will. So in your mercy, forgive whatever wrong they have done. By their faith, they were united with all your believing people. Now in love and mercy, give them a place with your angels and saints. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. For every invocation, we say, Lord, save your people. Lord, save your people. By your coming as man. Lord, save your By people. your birth. Lord, save your by your people. baptism and fasting. Lord, save your by people. By your suffering and cross. Lord, save your people. By your death and burial. Lord, save your people. By your rising to new life. Lord, save your people. By your returning glory to the Father. Lord, save your people. By your gift of the Holy Spirit. Lord, save your people. By your coming again in glory. Lord, save your people. Eternal rest grant unto them, O Lord. And let perpetual light shine upon them. May their souls and the souls of all faithful departed. Rest in peace. Amen. Let us pray. By the power of this sacrament, Lord, we pray, lead us always in your love through the example of blessed Martin de Porres and bring the fulfillment, the good work you have begun in us until the day of Christ Jesus who lives and reigns forever and ever. Amen. Maraming salamat po sa inyong pagdalo sa ating banal na misa. We continue to pray for our faithful departed. Meron po tayong envelopes for the souls. Uh, pwede po ninyong isulat ng mga pangalan ng mga yumao and we will pray for them for the whole month of November. Lagay nyo lang po dito sa harap yung pong envelope and we will include them in our prayer. Also, we continue to ask the intercession of St. Martin de Porres on behalf of the community po. I would like to thank the family of Cardinal Rufino Santos for entrusting this image and relic of St. Martin de Porres to us, to our community. Aalagaan po natin ito. Si St. Martin de Porres po, a very powerful intercessor for the sick and for those who are in great need 
of any financial assistance. And also, siya din po ay, meron, kung nakita niyo po yung image dito, hindi ko lang na-explain kanina, meron po siyang aso at uh, mga, or mga orphans na inaalagaan. Si St. Martin de Porres po, usually, is depicted as a saint na pinapakain yung mga, yung mga pusa, yung mga aso, yung mga ibon, tsaka yung mga daga in one plate. No? So, nagsasama-sama ang aso at pusa at daga sa iisang uh, plato. And that's the power of St. Martin de Porres. He loved everyone and cared for everyone. And I'm sure he would also extend his charity to us, interceding for our needs. Later, we will have a short adoration of the Blessed Sacrament and a procession to the Adoration Chapel. At 3 o'clock this afternoon, we will have our Divine Mercy Mass also. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. And may our loving God bless you and your family, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Our Mass has been offered. Go in peace to love and serve the Lord. Thanks be to God. Please kneel. Mm -hmm. Sacrament, most holy, O sacrament divine. All praise and all thanksgiving be every moment of time. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. The kingdom come, they will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. O sacrament most holy, O sacrament divine. All praise and all thanksgiving be every moment time. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. O sacrament most holy, O sacrament divine. All praise and all thanksgiving be every moment. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, a world without end. Amen. Novena prayer to the sacred heart of Jesus. Divine Jesus, you said, Ask and you shall receive. Seek and you shall find. Knock and it shall be opened unto you. Behold me kneeling at your feet, filled with a lively faith and confidence in the promises dictated by your sacred heart and pronounced by your adorable lips. I come to ask this favor. To whom can I turn if not to you, whose heart is the source of all graces and merits? Where should I seek if not in the treasure which contains all the riches of your kindness and mercy? Where should I knock if not at the door through which God gives himself to us and through which we go to God? I have recourse to you, heart of Jesus. In you I find consolation when afflicted, protection when persecuted, strength when burdened with trials, and light in doubt and darkness. Dear Jesus, 
I firmly believe you can grant me the grace I implore, even though it should require a miracle. You have only to will it, and my prayer will be granted. I admit that I am most unworthy of your favors, but this is not a reason for me to be discouraged. You are the God of mercy, and you will not refuse a contrite heart. Cast upon me a look of mercy, I beg of you, and your kind heart will find in my miseries and weaknesses a reason for granting my prayer. O oh, sacred heart, whatever may be your decision with regard to my request, I will never stop adoring, loving, praising, and serving you. My Jesus, be pleased to accept this my act of perfect resignation to the decrees of your adorable heart, which I sincerely desire may be fulfilled by me and your creatures forever. Sacred heart of Jesus, I know that there is but one thing impossible to you, to be without pity for those who are suffering or in distress. Look upon me, I beg of you, dear Jesus, and grant me the grace for which I humbly implore you, the Immaculate Heart of your most sorrowful mother. You have entrusted me to her as her child, and her prayers are all powerful with you. Amen. Sacramento Mirabili, Passionis to Way Memoriam Reliquisti, Tribue Quesunus, Itanos Corporis et Sanguinis, Dui Sacra Misteria Venerari, Utridim Sonis to Way Fructum in Nobis Yogiter Sensiamus, Qui Vivis et Renias in Secula Seculorum.
the divine praises. Blessed be God. Blessed be God. Blessed be His holy name. Blessed be His holy name. Blessed be Jesus Christ through God and through man. Blessed be Jesus Christ through God. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Blessed be His most sacred heart. Blessed be His most sacred. Blessed be His most precious blood. Blessed be His most precious. Blessed be Jesus in the most holy sacrament of the altar. Blessed be Jesus in the most holy sacrament. Blessed be the Holy Spirit of the Paraclete. Blessed be the Holy Spirit. The Blessed be the great mother of God, Mary most holy. Blessed be the great mother of God, Mary most Blessed holy. Blessed be her holy immaculate conception. Blessed be her holy immaculate conception. Blessed be her glorious assumption. Blessed be her glorious assumption. Blessed be the name of Mary, virgin and mother. Blessed be the name of Mary, virgin and mother. Blessed be Saint Joseph, her most chaste spouse. Blessed be Saint Joseph, her most chaste spouse. Blessed be God in his angels and in his saints. Blessed be God in his angels and in his saints. Amen. O sacrament most holy, O sacrament